hell is that? Oh, okay, a whale, two whales, and that must be a submarine. Looks like an alpha. Let's assume it's an alpha. Okay, what it is? There. Um. Okay. We are in a west coast. Let's make turns for ten knots. Next. Uh, okay, forty-one percent seems to be pretty good, pretty fast, and pretty far. No, I I will try to not sue the whales, the worry. Okay, let's get these two ready. Mm, 318 is this direction. Should get me a decent chance to do TMA on this dude. That's what I think I'm going to go. Oop! Nope. Oh, okay. I was only one. I thought I was at 370. Uh, well, that might have given him the chance to hear me. We'll see about that. Okay, 300 feet, good. Go ahead, start now. Not to 400. There. We are barely receiving <coughs> sound. And we are about to lose the contact, so I'm going to slow down a bit. There. I want to lose contact. 50% ah, Let me check uh, where is this guy going north or south South it seems good. That means we are in an opposite line of sight and uh, That should give us the best chance to get a proper TMA quick Roughly seven miles. We are pretty far away. Hmm. That's a problem. <laughs> That's a problem. Because that alpha can make 42 knots. And my torpedoes are good for 50. So if I shoot at this range, all he has to do is to run away. And I'm not going to hit him. Okay, let's do a little bit of time compression. Okay, we are receiving some active missions. We are far away for it not to be a problem, however. Alright. 75%. Soon we should have a proper solution. I'm going to do another leg. Not very steep. Only move to 300. To refine TMA even more. Then, 78%. Okay, pretty sure this guy is not going to pick us up. Okay, so if this is an alpha, what do I want to do? Obviously, I want to destroy it. That's a given. Uh, but again, with these torpedoes, this alpha is going to be a problem because it's very quick. And at this range, all he has to do is to turn away, accelerate to the top, and uh, I won't be able to catch him. So the idea is to approach him, try to win his rear, then go full speed behind him where he can't hear us, and put a torpedo on him before he even knows we are here. 
Sounds like a plan. But first I need to know exactly what it is. So let's give a little bit of time compression. There. Okay, we know what it is. So it's a burning of 252. If I go to a course of 280, I will be able to move uh, while tracking him with my passive sonar. I want to keep my toe of the way. Listen. And the toe of the way is behind you with uh, and is masked by your own submarine. So if it's back here, the, it can't hear past your position. So we need to be maybe 30 degrees of the position of the enemy submarine. Oh, he's turning away. That's good. Okay. Let's go to uh, 270, accelerate to two thirds, uh, to a head standard, 15 knots. Shouldn't be able to pick us up. No, he isn't. Good. Let's slip into his baffles and then accelerate towards him. We're currently at 7 miles. That's, f that's far too much. Really, it does look the part, don't you think? It looks like kind of a submarine race car. And <laughs> in many ways it is. The Alpha is, is really, really, really fast. Okay, we are about to enter. If he keeps the turn, we are going to be on his baffles. Then, of course, the problem is that if we go at full speed, we are going to lose track of him. Because currently, we are already having problems here with him. Only five decibels. Okay, let's use a little bit of the compression. Need to be very wary of this number not coming over 10. Because if he does, he's going to hear us. Also, now he's slightly turning south. Okay, he's slowed down. Slowing down, slowing down. We for ultra quiet. Don't think he's picked us up, but we lost his signal. We need to regain it. So now he's moving in his ultra quiet uh, engines. Yeah, the Alpha was made of titanium. And it wasn't the only one. The Sierra class also was made of titanium. And yet they were very, very, very uh, tough. Able to go very deep. Much deeper than US submarines. Okay, two thirds ahead again. He hasn't picked us up. However, my problem now is this the active signature. We are giving him a rather broad angle but I need to come into his baffle so we are pretty much forced to as we come down to 10 I will narrow the angle but in the meantime I'm going to keep this up he's moving only at 6 knots hey yo Masak Six and five. We have to be very careful with this. Because if he hears that, we are still six and a half miles away from him. Okay, compress time a little bit. He's turning. Okay, new course. Um, two five five. Let's narrow the angle so our Active signature is not over 10. He's not pinging, but if he pings, I don't want him to get a, a return on me. Actually, right now I'm picking him stronger with the um, whole sonar than with the toe of the ray, so I'm going to just go straight towards him. Course of 1, 1, 1, for one, one for zero. okay. <laughs> yeah, the toe of the ray lost the track. 
because he's masked behind us but it's not a problem right now we are picking him with the bow sonar and the active uh, signature is much 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 slower right now him going this slow is a problem however because I'm in a, on a permit and the permit is not what you'd call a very stealthy submarine uh, so I only can come that close towards him, you know ok, let's accelerate a little bit the time come closer we are coming very close to 10 very close Ok, new course, 235 Let's keep up pure pursuit And at 10 knots I think this is the closest we can get I am going to have to reduce the speed soon We have close to 5.5 miles Oh that's a p this is a problem, it's, it's really a problem. The permit is not the best submarine in the world. If I was in a 688, I could go 15 knots here and he wouldn't be able to, to hear me. Is he turning? Doesn't seem like he is. Seems to be in a steady... No, he's turning. He's actually putting a little bit... Very, very soft turn towards the left. I'm going to have to slow down really, really soon. Uh, hello, Midrashi. Uh, Masak, uh, the Alpha is a submarine that can go at 42 knots. My torpedoes, when active, uh, can go at 50. Uh, if I fire from this range, and uh, he just turns tails and uh, goes at full speed, he cannot run my torpedo. I mean, uh, the torpedo will rent, uh, will be out of fuel before it reaches it. So I want to be much closer before I open fire. Okay, let's compress time a little bit. Okay, if he goes active now, he's going to detect us. And slow down to two, uh, five knots. We might as well go silent. At five knots is what it is. I mean, another thing we could do is he surfacing. Interesting. Yeah, that's cool. But where are we? He's on the surface. Well, he doesn't know we are around, you know. I mean, so he might as well. Why not? Um. I can keep the torpedo, I mean, the torpedo has two settings, right? If I fire now, for instance, this is your fire control for the torpedo. Right now I have this torpedo selected. This blue line means the run of the torpedo um, when it's going inactive. When it's going inactive, it's just going in a straight line and it's not going to acquire anything, it's not going to turn on anything, it's not going to do anything, just going. When it reaches the box, then it will go active. On the passive run, the Mark uh, 48, I think it goes at 40 knots. And at 40 knots, it makes us, makes a lot less noise. But even then, um, he's only moving at 6 knots. There's a strong ch chance that he will hear the torpedo. Um, while it's still pretty far away. So what I want to do is just to stay put on the rear of this guy. Wait for him to turn on this direction if possible and then I will go to full power because once we are just behind him he won't be able to hear us because the alpha here has not all the ray so he only has a bow sonar and the bow sonar can't hear behind yeah I, we have two humpbacks here let's take a look at them if they zoom there 
allows us to it's just minding their their own business. And they are singing. Okay. Let's come left to a course of 255. Try to lead him a bit. Oh, he really is singing. I don't know what he's doing in the surface, but whatever. Okay, accelerate time a little bit. Okay, now he's accelerating so we can go faster. Is he diving? Yeah, he has it. Now he's moving at 12 knots. I would really like him to turn this way. Since I heard a ping. He's pinging now and then, but at this speed he's not as effective as he was at six knots, so he can't hear us yet. Okay. Distance five miles. Really really careful here. Yeah he's emitting but he can't have a return yet. He will soon, however. Okay, he's turning away. It seems. He's in a southerly course. Let's see if we can sneak behind him. If we can, then we can really accelerate close the distance with him. And conduct an attack. But at this rate, I'm going to give him a return before we can, so that's unfortunate. Let's lead him a little bit. Come on, turn a little bit away. He's very close to the surface. Turns. No, but he's if he's doing south, southeast, south, south, southeast. I need to cross behind him, but he's not giving me the chance. It's unfortunate. I can't really accelerate more than this, can I? Let's try to go 15 knots. Let's watch this carefully. Uh, no, 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 we can't go at 15. He will hear us. So let's slow down. Okay. Keep on going. For now, he's not getting returns on us. He doesn't know we're here. But active sonar is at 10. He probably is going to get a return on me soon. <sighs> That's bad. Also no layer, so... It's important. Let's try to turn towards his bearing precisely to delay. Yeah. To delay the... The time he has to acquire us, yes. Active sonar return is slower now because the le less profile we give him, the more difficult time he has to get the sound waves returning to him and picking them up. Uh, okay, so and this is a problem, really, it is. My submarine is not silent enough to come much closer than this. 
and um, we need to be closer than this. We really do. That's a problem. It's four miles and a half away still. It's far too too well. Too long range. But if he pings now, uh, he was pinging. Okay, let's. Now he's turning south again. Okay, now we are in his baffles. Now we are in his baffles. Flank speed ahead. Flank speed ahead. Yeah, no way I'll capitating, I don't care. Let's dive deeper. But right now, we can take the advantage that he can't hear us. Let's sleep right behind him. Go, 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 go. Okay, capitation stopped. Can we hear him? Yeah, we can hear him. He's still moving at 12 knots, he doesn't know we're here. Now, if he begins turning left again, he might take us off our out of his above falls. But he's doing pretty much the same length of legs, so I do have quite a little bit of time to close into him. As a rating, 26 knots, level of the submarine, we are deep enough. Go, go, go. This handbag is like, right now it's like, what the fuck is in front of me? <laughs> because we were going really, really quiet and now we are making quite a little bit of noise. <coughs> okay, closing, closing, closing. He's on a burning of 201. We are on a course of 207. That's not a lot. I'm going to cut across towards his rear. New course two to zero or so. That should put us in his baffles, but in a much more solid way. Uh, we need to be careful because once he turns, if we are, if we have not traveled far enough down this line, when he turns, he will he will pick us up. So go 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 so Permit is not especially quick, it's 28 knots. But I guess that's better than, I don't know, a studio, not 25, right? We are barely picking him up, however. We might lose track of his contact. But right now I can't slow down. We need to sneak behind him as much as we can. Um, Okay, this is... We are maybe 15 degrees of his... ...course. Which means that if he turns this way, we will be in his baffles. No, damn it. Don't turn yet. Don't turn yet, please. Keep steady. Don't turn. This leg was too shallow, maybe. I m should probably have turned as soon as he turned away. Now we went in his waffles. But we have reduced the distance to 4 miles. That's really good. Okay, let's be really mindful of these numbers. As soon as they begin changing, I need to go silent. At least if they decrease. If they increase, I don't care, because that would mean that he was turning this way. But, but if they decrease, that means that he'll be turning left. Go, 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 come on, come on. Three minutes and a half, closing. We might even be able to see him from here. Not yet. Don't want to use time compression right now because... There, 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 there! 
quiet, 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 he's turning. Number changing. Reduce speed, come on, we need to come down to five knots before he can hear us. Let's see if his turn puts out puts uh, our position out of his buffers. Seems it doesn't so far. We still are behind him, we still are on his buffers. This number stabilize. We will know if we were able to sneak behind him. He keeps on turning, however, seems to be steady on a course of 162, more or less, and we are still on his buffers. Still decreasing. Okay, what I'm going to do, something different, ping, we need a left tube, this one, to go on this track, I hope he doesn't hear the torpedo transient, let's analyze his movement, No answer. He didn't hear us fighting. Good. So the idea is we send the torpedo here. I'm going to actually send the set the line there. Torpedo on this bearing. When it's just behind him, we will throw it just up his ass. Also, I don't know if I want to... No, 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 let's replace it here. I was thinking of setting it on passive and activating it to guide them manually, guide it manually. But I can guide it manually right now, right? Okay, needs to be around here before we dogleg it. still are in his, um, in his waffles, so he can't hear us, he can't hear us, he can't hear this torpedo. So actually, let's begin there. Throwing it towards him. Don't ask me why I'm having really bad frames. Ugh. Okay. Okay, next leg he's going to do is going to be southwards. So this torpedo is safe here. You won't be hearing it anytime soon. Another thing is that it's pretty um, shallow, so we are going to have to guide it manually. I'm going to set it on passive. Torpedo will keep its depth until activated, and then we have given it orders to go up. Still on his waffles. But I spilled hair, I mean this this um, sprint really got us behind him. Okay, let's do a little bit of time compression. Okay, I'm guessing this is enough. Let's begin send it, sending the torpedo its way. And uh, well, it's in passive, right? Activate it, and 
already to go up. Alpha is capitating, Alpha is capitating. Did he pick torpedo up? Suren. Maybe, maybe it's here, did. Maybe. But bad luck, man, because now you have a torpedo one mile behind you, not four. Oh, these frames, what the hell is happening? Okay. Man, when this game, that, this battle is over, I'm going to check on. Okay, broken wire, whatever. I'm going to have to check on my system, I don't know what the hell is going up. Performance is down to shit. Well, as long as he's cavitating, this is going to have a solid. Um, a solid fix, so yeah. Look at him, 40 knots. Hey. I don't know, Masak. Maybe something is uploading on the uh, downloading on Steam or something, some update of a game or I don't know what. But yeah, this is Windows 10. Uh, but yeah, performance suddenly went to shit and I don't know why. Okay, coming closer. Probably half a mile behind. Yeah, even even fully active, the torpedo is taking his merry time to come closer. Those, ooh, what the? Oh, knuckle! It is a knuckle on the water that distracted the torpedo for a second, but he's regained contact. Now he's turning. Torpedo turns to lead it. We have a solid fix here. Also, by the way, no, he doesn't have us. And... Uh, was that enough? Yep, that was enough. That's a fast diving <laughs> alpha right now. I don't want to mess up with my SO uh, massacre. Because if I don't have any kind of trouble, my machine will go to hell. I mean, it's what it is. Okay. I'm quite, quite proud of myself. That worked out really, really well. The whole infiltration behind, being patient, leaving it, uh, giving me a good chance to come behind him. 